Hey, what's up everybody? John here, and this is gonna be this week's edition of the Family Garden Update. Kelly and I are gonna be out of town this weekend, so we're not gonna be around to do an update on Saturday. So this is midweek, it's Wednesday evening, and we'll just do a little run through. Well, our zucchini and our squash, they really perked up real nice and we're excited, happy about the, happy about the way that they look um, after Kelly transplanted them. And uh, real quick, here's the lettuce. I mean, that corner there, right through the middle and a little bit over here, it's uh, still coming up, looking pretty good. Our tomato plant here, it's, Grown about another, I don't know, three inches tall, but right in the middle, see right there. Looks to me like we're gonna have some uh, flowers popping out, which in turn means tomatoes. Just a real quick run through. So there's our pepper plants, the other squash and zucchini. tomatoes now the potatoes potatoes over there peas right there and take a look we've got got some pods growing over here like I said last Saturday, our cucumbers, check it out. Still almost growing exponentially. Now we had to make an executive decision on our cabbages. We were using the neem. We were hoping that it would do real nice, that it would prevent uh, further damage. It did not. They actually came out, we had four more cabbage plants that were damaged and eaten on by worms. And Kelly found three more worms and squashed them. So we got rid of those and we had to do something. So we got some seven and uh, we didn't really want to, but it's either that or just let the cabbages 
go to the worms and yeah we don't want to do that we want to eat the cabbages that's the whole reason that we have a garden is so that we can eat what we planted what we produced you know we're disappointed about some of the peas but excited about the ones that are growing and you know i i don't know i've said before growing a garden it's it's hit or miss it's come and go but we're going to do the things that we need to do that we can do to uh get rid of some of the bugs so and we're having a whole bunch of holes getting eaten in the beans so we dusted those two um, spaghetti squash looking good cantaloupe continuing their progress more tomatoes more flowers means more tomatoes the spaghetti squash finally started perking up a little more after Kelly fed them I know I perk up after I get fed another tomato plant there I think we're trying to figure out if we gave it too much water or not enough. Not sure. Yeah, so just kind of running through real quick. Not a whole lot of change to much since Saturday. And we've got flowers going on strawberry plants. Look out through there, we've got a runner sticking out, another runner sticking out there. I don't know. Look at that runner sticking way out here. So, more runners, more plants, more strawberries. onions looking decent garlic and herbs all right so that's it uh, that's all I got just a little run through midweek and if you like the garden videos would you just go ahead and hit the like button on this one and if you've not yet subscribed go do that for me and ring the notification bell if you want to see more uh more videos like this and um yeah so you guys have a great rest of your day whenever you're watching this thanks for watching and uh, we'll talk to you next time